So here is a game called Swimming Simulator 2013, and uh, I mean it's been out since last year and I still unfortunately have not played it, even though I'm a huge fan of swimming. I mean, I don't like to talk about this a lot because I've been arrested for it before, but I love swimming. I, not just swimming, I love a lot of water-based activities, like I enjoy bathing at least once a week, sometimes I enjoy drinking water even. So water has been a huge part of my life since I was at least 16 years old. I've been really involved in it. And uh, I did um, uh, basically any kind of well, game where they're swimming, I, I, I do play it and I enjoy it. And I mean some of the greatest games of all time have swimming mechanics like um, uh, Assassin's Creed, um, Lara Croft, uh, World of Warcraft, and of course the classic Swimming Simulator 2012. So is Swimming Simulator 2013 going to stand up to the grain? Is it going to be as good as those classics? There's only way to, one way to find out. Let's do a live review and see if it's any good or not. Let's play the game. Okay, so here I am, um, the time is at the top right, and the time is going upwards instead of downwards, so I don't know, I guess the time, there is no timer basically. And right now I feel like we're just walking in shallow water, we're not re really swimming. Perhaps I need to press a button to dive, or, uh, I'm just gonna keep walking, because I don't know what button does anything, and space doesn't do anything, so I'm just gonna walk. This is more like, instead of a swimming simulator, this is a lot more like a Jesus simulator where we simulate walking on water from one Jerusalem island to another, basically. Uh, is, does Jerusalem have a lot of islands? Am I thinking of, uh, of uh, Israel or, or am I confusing Israel with Hawaii? I always get those two confused. So here we are almost at this giant uh, belly and perhaps this will be the uh, end of the level once we get to it, once we walk to it. and. Oh, okay. It's it's making the uh, the swimming or walking on water noises as we're on the land as well. So as we're walking on land, it's making the noises like we're walking on on um on the water. Which I will take points off for that because typically when you walk on land, you would want footsteps or the steps of running or no sound at all. It's better than the sound of um uh stepping on water because there's clearly no water here there's no puddles it's just a big flat piece of land which looks like a giant potato which um i don't know if this is the spiritual prequel to uh that uh explorer game we played uh, a year ago or so but uh just I i'm actually gonna uh, i'm gonna restart the game and see maybe i can dive because i feel like i am walking and i uh, maybe i haven't gotten to the actual swimming portion of the game Okay, so we're back in a new uh, playthrough of uh, Swimming Simulator 2013, and I, I did check out basically all everywhere, and I didn't see the, uh, like the actual uh, controls. So I'm assuming all the controls are the WASD button, since the controls are written down anywhere. And uh, since that's the case, there's really no way to dive. So this is as close to swimming as we're going to get in this game, kind of walking on water, which I feel like is what better than swimming. I mean, if I see someone swimming, I'll go. Okay, whatever. If I see someone walking on water, I might be a little excited. I'll be like, wow, that guy is walking on water. That's quite an impressive feat. So I was going to take points off for the fact that you're not really swimming, but walking on water or floating above the water. But now that I think about it, floating or above the water or walking on it is way cooler than swimming. So I'm actually going to add points. So uh, my final rating for this game is pretty simple because you do still make uh, um, uh, water walking noises once you're walking on land, I take a point off, but then I add a point because it's really cool that you're walking on water or floating on water. So this game gets an official Stan Birdman rating of a 10 out of 10, I mean, it's pretty much the perfect game. I can't think of a better way to spend an afternoon. What I would love to see is some kind of Michael Phelps DLC or anything where you can swim or at least walk on water a little faster. Other than that, it's basically the best game I ever played. Thanks for watching. Goodbye, my friends. Could use a sky, too. I wish they would have added in a sky. But I mean, just the blue, blue um, background in the air, that's okay too. I mean, I guess it's just a really foggy day and you can't see the sky and the sun and the moon or something. I'm not going to take points off for it though. I'm feeling generous today. It's still a 10 out of 10. Bye.